he will probably be quickest to 150 goals too. Klopp hails, exceptional, Salah after he brings up Liverpool ton. The German head coach was full of praise for the Egyptian striker after seeing him set a new top-flight mark for the Reds. Jurgen Klopp hailed Mohamed Salah as exceptional, after seeing him bring up his Premier League ton for Liverpool while also claiming, he'll probably be the quickest player to score 150 goals too. Salah scored his 100th top-flight goal for Liverpool in his 151st appearance in the competition against Brentford on Saturday becoming the fastest player in the club's history to reach the milestone. The Egyptian forward also entered the Reds' top 10 goal scorers of all time, behind legends such as Ian Rush, Steven Gerrard and Kenny Dalglish, and Klopp singled him out for praise after the 3-3 draw. That's exceptional. I think two weeks ago he scored 100 in the league. Now 100 for Liverpool, the Liverpool boss said of Salah's achievements in his post-match press conference. We give him already the shirt with the 100 on the back. Maybe we now have to give him another one. Exceptional. We all know that. In the future when people look back, people will speak about some players of this team 100% and will speak 100% as well about Mo Salah because the numbers he had are insane, incredible. I know Mo. He's now sitting in the dressing room and thinking about the two chances he didn't score. He'll probably be the quickest player to score 150 goals too it's an outstanding achievement, no doubt. Klopp went on to reflect on a thrilling contest at the Brentford Community Stadium that ultimately saw the Reds miss the chance to open up a three-point lead at the top of the table. The German head coach conceded the hosts were good value for a point after a fearless performance, but also lamented his side's wastefulness. It was a wild ride, Klopp told Sky Sports. They deserved their three goals for the way they played. We obviously couldn't deal with the long balls today but we should have scored more goals. I don't think you can control them much better, we created a lot of clear-cut chances but couldn't deal with them defensively. These things happen, we should have scored more. If we win 3-2 or 4-3 we still have these struggles defensively. Tony and Mabumo did really well. They deserved a point as well because they put up a proper fight. I respect that a lot. In the end, there were situations we should do better, and then it could be a completely different game. Their goalie should have number 10 on his shirt with the balls that he played. 